Are you one who lives with one foot in the world and one foot in the kingdom of God? Do you know that Satan loves to take your attention off of God only to draw it to the world, to draw it to your fleshly desires and your earthly pursuits? The Bible's clear that we are not to live in this world as double-minded followers of Christ. James, the brother of Jesus, rebukes the double-minded man. The man that lives with a divided heart is a foolish man. It was King David who cried out, Teach me your way, O Lord, that I may walk in your truth. Give me an undivided heart that I may fear your name. Jesus taught that divided loyalties are of no use in God's kingdom. He said no one can serve two masters, for you will hate one and love the other. You will be devoted to one and despise the other. Instead, we are to fix all of our affection on the treasure that we have in Jesus. When we pray like David prayed, Lord, give me an undivided heart, we are asking the Lord to transform our wayward hearts that we might be completely sold out in our reverence for God and obedience to Him. Friends, love for the world and love for God are mutually exclusive, period. It's one or the other. There's no play in the middle. Drop me a comment below and let me know how you're doing giving God your whole heart.